Hey guys, it's Jake here from Team C4G and I'm here with Co Cody Mungakahi. Uh, he's just won Dragon Duels at YCS 2024. Um, Cody, why don't you tell us what you're playing? Oh, I'm playing the best deck in the format, Life Twin Root Sprite. <laughs> um, cool, alright. It's a tight choice between Hand Trap Sprite and this. Yeah. Playing this for Cool, alright, so take us through the list, ma'am. Uh, so for the Sprite cards, we have three blue. Uh, I don't see playing two. Uh, comes up way too much. Uh, three bodies. Uh, one red. Um, don't play two. Don't need two. Nice. One jet. Uh, jet starter. Pretty good. Smashes. Pretty good. Uh, one carrot. Won me a game against Sky Strikers. Pretty good card. So that's it for the sprite cards. Uh, for the live twins, we've got three live Pingula. Um, the better one because it can summon the frost. But we'll get into that in a second. Uh, two key skill. You don't summon this one or this one. You would summon this one. Yep. Um, and that's it for the live twins. That's it? Okay. For the hand traps, we've got three Ash Blossom. Um, isn't the most effective this format, but won me a game against Snake Eye uh, when I Ash their wanted poster. Uh, three Valor, better than Imperm, because I like to use it as soon as I can. So that's pretty good. That's it for the main deck hand traps. Uh, for the runic cards, uh, we've got two Fountain. Can't play three. Isn't good at one if it gets banished. Uh, three Tip. Uh, Search Slumber won me so many games. Uh, three Flashing. Target Olympus Shanima. Easy win. Uh, three Freezing. Pretty good negate. Uh, the three Destruction. Works really well against Re Rescue Ace Snake Eye. Uh, targeted all of his things. Three Slumber. Three Slumber for um, protect my uh, Hugin and draw three. And my favourite one today, uh, Dispelling. Being able to hand rip. So good. Yep. Um, that's and it. What made you play the Dispelling over anything else? Um, just being able to hand rip uh, helps a lot. Because uh, they add something and then on res, uh, I just do that and it rips card and banishes. Uh, yep. Like draw, but in my opinion, worse. <laughs> but um, yep. helps because they can banish to get fountain activation and rip a card. So that's why I chose the spell. Awesome. That's it for the runic package. Uh, for the other spells, we've got Sunny Snitch. Uh, usually just sided it out, didn't come up much. Mm -hmm. uh, we've got one called by came up against um, Rescue Ace Snake Eye. When he impulsed, uh, I would chain called by and I'd win. Nice. Uh, Talents won me a game against Sky Striker because uh, he had no monsters and I returned his talents so that I could red negate, current negate, life to combo and start it. Uh, don't main, I don't mean smashes because I don't think it comes out much as most cards that are good this format can just dodge smashes. But that's it for the main deck cards. Cool. For the extra deck, uh, we're running uh, live twin package. So we've got two key skill. Uh, can't play one. Doesn't it? If it gets banished, you lose. Uh, two Lilla. The pop won me again. So many games because I can just clear their entire back row with one turn. In one turn, and then trouble sunny. Um, battle phase won me a game. Uh, two won me two games. Uh, so good with the non-targeting send. Send to the grave, not destroy. Yep, nice. Uh, it's great card. For the non-engine, we've got one Muckracker to revive Trouble Sunny. Uh, one Abomination, one IP, uh, and SP. Uh, thank you, Daniel. Way better <laughs> than Griffin. Don't play Griffin if you can yeah, get your hands bad. on SP. Uh, with Griffin, you can set one of your runics that's in grave, but I'd much rather have them for Fountain. Uh, and then, that's pretty much it for the non end Oh, and then, one Typhon. Didn't help at all. I uh, was there for moral support. Yep. Um, you heard it here first, Typhon bad. Yeah. Um, most of the monsters this full meant a small attack. Yep. So, didn't come up too much. Uh, for the runics, we've got one Gary. Didn't come up at all. 
Uh, I'd rather play something else, but it's there for recursion. Uh, two Hugin with the mismatching rarities. So nice. <laughs> nice. Um, searching Fountain and the baiting out Ash at Vela. Uh, so good. Then we have for the Sprite package one Gigantic and one Sprint. Uh, came up a lot when I got Valid Ash on my Live Twins. So then I could just keep playing. Uh, Gigantic okay. only play one. He's really good, uh, but with full combo, you don't really need it. Uh, but to get blue, so it's there if you need it. It's there if you need it, but um, usually use it to just get IP and Live Twins on board. Yep, no worries. And uh, now for the sides. Side. Yep. Yeah, so we've got three Ghost Bell, uh, one me game against Sky Striker. Uh, then three Droll, um, good against Snake Eye. Didn't use it though, because it didn't come up. Uh, red resonated for time. Uh, <laughs> no, it's, a, it's a level two normal summon. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Re red resonator for the level, yeah, normal summon. Yeah, but um, it's time to summon a level two. Yeah, it's that's a, it. Yeah, yeah it's time. That's it. Yeah. Because uh, Runic does take me into time. So red resonator is always there. Smashes in the side. Because. Um, like I said, most things that are with this format can dodge uh, smashes. And, uh, three cosmic uh, didn't burst any snake eye or Viking snake eye, mm -hmm. uh, but it looked good in my side deck. <laughs> uh, three droplet uh, didn't use it once, but the uh, fly twin uh, combo with it would have made up for that. And then mannequin cat in the side. Uh, would take it out for Typhon, but uh, didn't use it once this entire event. Uh, so that is my deck list. Cool. Um, so just quickly take us through a bit of your matchups. What did you verse over the day? So uh, game one, uh, I versed Rescue Ace Snake Eye. Uh, draw f activating all my things in draw phase really won me the game. Um, Imperm and Flashing Fire. Uh, Imperm pretty good against uh, that even though I didn't play it but flashing fire targeting the turbulence on my turn because then he didn't control any um, rescue ace monsters won me the game uh, game two against snake eye a uh, great game game one um, he had opened two hand traps and three cards in hand uh, I set up red carrot and I had ash and Baylor in my hand uh, more negates and cards he had in hand great matchup though uh, went 2-1, game 2, uh, couldn't out the Flamberge, open, didn't open Bell or any hand traps, if that, uh, went okay, still won in the end, because uh, of game 2, I lost because of Summer Limit and Summer Limit only, um, couldn't make any of my things that I had full combo for, couldn't summon any red, couldn't summon any jet, um, couldn't summon SP, unfortunately, so I just had to scoop there. I passed, then he just destroyed my board. Not much I could do. Uh, game three against Snake Eye. Uh, round three against Snake Eye. Uh, he opened Flamberge two Delta, uh, the Psy Flame with Delta uh, in Bonfire. Uh, Ash the Bonfire, he couldn't play. He just resigned here, I think. So that's where my merch shops. Game three uh, against Sky Striker. He opened four spells in an Ash, uh, or a Baylor, whatever it was. Uh, couldn't do much. I had talents in hand, so I uh, talents. He had talents in hand, so I got rid of the talents, which allowed me to do my red carrot life and play in IP. So game two against Sky Striker, flawless. Uh, I'm saying he bricked, but let's just say that he didn't. Uh, so those were my matchups really hard game today. No, but you did well, man. And um, just for the record, is uh, how many YCSs have you done before today? This is my first one. Awesome work, man. Congratulations. Thank you. All right.